Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to solve another problem. Pro problem is range sum of VST. So in this problem, what we need to do is we are given a root of a binary search tree. Just make sure it's not a binary tree, it's a binary search tree. And two integers, low and high. Return the sum of values of all nodes with a value in the inclusive range, inclusive, low and high. So I hope you understood what the problem is. Uh, in the problem, we have to return sum of all those nodes which have value between low to high, inclusive. So let's see, uh, let's take this test case. So if you see, we have to return sum. So uh, we have to return sum of all nodes which lie, who, whose values, node values lie between low and it should, it could be equal to low also and high less than high so this is our main thing which we need to check so let's see in this tree we'll start from the root now see this 10 this 10 lies between le, uh, low and high it lies between low and high so low is 7 and 10 is lies between this range so we can take 10 so 10 will be one of our uh, will add to our sum and now we will make one call left and one call to the right so let's go left now so our left uh, now our root uh, pointer will come here so see now this is 5 this 5 is less than left this 5 is less than left so left is given to us 7 and it's less than fi uh, 5 is less than 7 also in BST we know that if uh, all the values to the left of the root are less than root less than root and all the values to the right of the root are greater than root so if this 5 is only less than 7 it's not in this range then should we go to the left of this there is no point now see this is only less than uh, uh, this is this this only does not lie in this range it's less than the low value so all the values to this to the left of this to the left of this 5 will be less than only 5 so those also will not fall in this range and those also will not be included in our sum so when our root value so when our root value root value is less than the low the low then we what we will do is we will make a recursive call for the right only for the root roots right only earlier what we did was when this 10 see when the ten, when this 10 10 was lying between this this range that is 10's roots value in this in this 10's case was uh, greater than equal to l and less than equal to right then what we did was we added the root value to our final answer plus we did the recursive call to the left we go to 5 this this left call to the left and we also do we will also do to the for, for uh, right recursive call this was this one case but when we are over here when the root value is only less than left uh, low then we will not go to the left tree uh, left, left sub tree will go to the right so over here we go here after this 5 5 will not be included because it does not lie in the range now 7 lies in the range it's equal to a low so 7 will be added in our sum and since there is no left and right child no further call will be made now we have uh, we have gone through this call the left call for the root now we'll go to the right so over here we will check for 15 so 15 uh, is 15 lies in the range 15 is equal to high value so we will add 15 in our answer and since there is uh, this this will be the case now since there is no left child we'll go to the right we'll execute the la, uh, right call and we'll go here 18 is also 18 is not included in this range see 18 is greater than high so 18 will not be included in our answer so our answer will be 17 plus 15 it will be 32 see our output is output is 32 
so i hope you and uh, you have understood what we did so there are three cases in total let's discuss i'll i'll highly recommend just pause the video and try to make the third test case a uh, third third case this was the first case when the root value root value was uh, lies in the range it was lying in the range then what we did was that if this is the case then we may uh, we added the root value and we have made the left call and the right call but when our root value root value was less than uh, left then we did not make the left call we only made the right call also we will not include the root value because obviously it's not in the range so why to include it uh, so we will only make to the root right root right right call uh, otherwise just pause the video and make the another case so another case will be that if the root value is greater than right if the root value is greater than right then obviously it's it's not getting in the inclusive range it's not in the range so the all the nodes which are right to right on the right subtree of this node will be greater than this root value so those also will not lie in the range so we will only make the left call we'll only make the left call so i hope you understood it the logic and the approach now let's see the code if you understood the approach uh, the code is very simple so if we are just checking this that if the root is null return 0 there is nothing in the tree otherwise if the root value lies in the range add the root value and do the left call do the right call else if if the root value is less than l means all the nodes which are on the left subtree will also be less than l uh, so there is no point of doing left call just do right call and in the else we'll do the left call only so i hope you understood the uh, code it's very easy so if you like the video please like it share with your friends subscribe to my channel i'll see you in the next video bye